Look at this water. It looks like it's just water, right? But it has lead in it, and you just can't see it. You can't smell it or taste it either, which makes it hard to detect. This has actually been a massive problem for decades, as lead is extremely toxic and is associated with some serious long-term health effects, like developmental delays in children, reproductive issues, and high blood pressure. And lead in our water systems is more common than you think. The Environmental Protection Agency estimates that up to 9 million homes in the U.S. use pipes that are made out of lead, meaning that tens of millions of Americans are likely exposed to lead. And this has been a problem for decades, which is why the Biden administration's EPA took a historic and significant step to combat this, by establishing a standard requiring the vast majority of communities to swap out their lead pipes over 10 years so that everyone can have access to safer drinking water. More than half of Americans are drinking tap water that could be toxic. Lead pipes were outlawed 36 years ago. And in addition to the rule, the previous administration's EPA started work to distribute $15 billion in federal funds for lead pipe replacements to support the effort to replace nearly all lead pipes by 2037. That progress could be under threat from the Trump administration. But if these standards and investments continue, the EPA estimates that every year they will reduce up to 1,500 cases of premature death from heart disease, protect up to 900,000 infants from having low birth weight, and prevent up to 2,600 children from developing ADHD. We must continue this progress. We can't turn back. Follow us to keep up with more environmental news.